I'm Chef Frank, this is Proto Cooks, and welcome back to another episode of Pinch of Frank. Today we're making a Paloma. So this is my take on a Paloma, and a Paloma is a close cousin of a margarita, right? It's got grapefruit juice, lime juice, um, it has grapefruit soda, and I'm gonna use a little agave syrup as well. Here are the ingredients. Salt for the rim of the glass. Grapefruit soda, agave syrup, a silver tequila, about a half a grapefruit, it could be pink or regular grapefruit, and about a half a lime. I have a few pieces of specialized equipment that you could buy over time and build your bar out, right? Uh, I've been buying pieces of equipment for my bar for quite some time, so start building your bar. Measuring cups, you always wanna measure out uh, your, your drinks. A juice squeezer for squeezing fresh citrus. Squeeze fresh citrus, don't use this stuff in a bottle, it's not good a julep strainer, and then a mixing spoon. This is a bar mixing spoon, okay? Um, and that's what you need, like build out your bar. These aren't expensive uh, pieces of equipment and uh, I guarantee your drinks will get better. Before we move on to the cocktail, I wanna talk about a couple ingredients. First is grapefruit soda. All I could find was Italian grapefruit soda, but if you can find Mexican grapefruit soda, even better. Uh, Yaritos or Squirt are really good for this, uh, but grapefruit soda. Agave syrup. Now, this cocktail doesn't necessarily need uh, any sweetener. I like to put a little sweetener in it. You can use simple syrup, but if you can find agave syrup, use it. It's delicious, and tequila's made from agave, so you're kind of using parts of the same plant. All right, let's make the cocktail. Uh, you notice in front of me that I have two glasses. One glass is my serving glass, the other glass I'm gonna build my drink in. So the first thing I'm gonna do is get my grapefruit, and I'm just gonna run my grapefruit around the rim of this glass, because I'm gonna salt it, right? And then you take your glass, and you put some salt on it, right? You can use tagine too for this if you like something a little spicy. That's like a Mexican spice mix. It's a little spicy, it's a little sour, right? Um, and then I'm gonna start building my cocktail in my, in my cup, okay? Uh, the first thing I'm gonna do is two ounces of silver, silver, there goes my Long Island accent, two ounces of silver tequila. You can probably use a slightly aged tequila, but I think the silver is a little better for this. So two ounces of tequila, all right? Um, I have the agave syrup. I'm gonna do one bar spoon of agave syrup, right? If you like a little sweeter, that's fine. Uh, but I like to put this in here and start to dissolve it, right? Uh, I'm gonna use half of a lime, juice of half a lime, and I'm gonna squeeze that right into my glass. Right, and then I'm gonna basically use about the juice of half of a grapefruit. That goes directly into my glass too. Make sure you get it all in there. Squeeze. Dump it in. Yeah, there we go. Like I said earlier, you always wanna use fresh juices. They're the best. Uh, that's what you should be using. Good. Okay, and now what I wanna do is make sure that my agave syrup is dissolved, right? So it's dissolved, I'm gonna get my julep scoop, I'm gonna put some ice in this and I'm gonna chill this drink thoroughly. While I chill it, I'm gonna put the ice in my serving glass and get my serving glass cold as well. There you go. And now I'm just gonna, I'm gonna stir this until it gets nice and chilled. I'm gonna make sure that it's really mixed well. Look at the bottom, make sure none of my agave syrup is still down there, all right? I'm gonna take a little garnish wedge of grapefruit, a little wheel of lime on top, and I'm gonna put these on top because when I drink the drink, I wanna get some salt, and I wanna smell the lime and grapefruit. I get my julep strainer, strain over the top. My grapefruit soda. Grapefruit soda goes in. And I'm just gonna lightly stir it just to try and get it mixed well. And that's it, that's my Paloma. All right, let's give it a try. Oh man, these are addictive and dangerous. Um, it's a lot different than a margarita, 
It's not as sweet. It's a little more refreshing, uh, but it's absolutely delicious. You got to give it a try. I hope you enjoyed this video. If it did, give us a thumbs up, like, and subscribe. Hit the little bell to get notifications when we have new videos. We have merch in the link down below. We also have a PO box down there. I'd like to thank our Patreon patrons for supporting us. We really appreciate it. Uh, and that's it. That's a Paloma. I'm Chef Frank. This is Proto Cooks. <laughs>